Subaru has taken the wraps off the Solterra, its first all-electric vehicle to be launched globally, at a global event based in Japan. The Solterra will be available to order in the UK from the middle of 2022. There's no word on pricing yet, but when Subaru's new electric car eventually arrives in Britain, it'll offer fresh competition for the likes of the Ford Mustang Mach-E and the Skoda and Yak 4. The electric SUV was developed in conjunction with Toyota, which is one of Subaru's largest investors, according to a report from Reuters. So, in this video, we're gonna tell you about the 2023 Subaru Solterra electric crossover. The video is gonna be amazing, so make sure you stick to the end. Before starting the video, be sure to smash that like button and subscribe to never miss out on any of our videos. The Solterra has been developed jointly with Toyota, which recently announced its first fully electric vehicle, the BZ4X, will be available to buy in late 2022. The companies have combined Subaru's all-wheel drive technology with Toyota's vehicle electrification technology to create the new SUV. The technological shift away from the internal combustion engine poses a challenge for smaller car makers such as Subaru, which have been less able to fund the costly development of EVs. Also, it's an opportunity for top-tier automakers like Toyota to bring smaller rivals closer. Toyota Pioneer of hybrid electric cars, but a latecomer to the full EV market, plans to have a lineup of 15 BEV models by 2025. It's spending $13.5 billion over the next decade to expand auto battery production capacity. The Solterra can enable DC fast charging up to 150 kilowatts when the battery is running low. However, Subaru didn't say how long it'll take. In comparison, Toyota claims that charging its BZ4X, which is based on the same EV platform, to 80% capacity will take 30 minutes. The BZ4X, which will be released in 2022, will be based on a shared platform, which Toyota refers to as the ETNGA and Subaru refers to as the eSubaru. Based on the WLTC standard in Japan, both models include a 71.4 kWh battery under the floor that Subaru believes will provide roughly 530 km, 329 miles of range. In the United States, the EPA rating is likely to be lower. The all-wheel drive version will have a range of 460 km, 286 miles. The two grades available would include the front-driven entry-level car with a single motor generating 201 horsepower and 195 pound-foot of torque. Subaru Star Drive is engineered with the latest breakthroughs in electric vehicle technology to deliver substantial on-demand torque at all speeds for exciting everyday driving. It offers an enhanced driving experience through features like paddle shifters, an extra responsive sport mode, and one pedal driving which uses the regenerative braking system to allow you to keep your foot on the throttle for more convenience. It may be the first of its kind, but the Solterra is still a Subaru at heart. The twin motor flagship Solterra, which employs four wheel drive technology developed by Subaru, lifts power to 215 horsepower and slices its 0 to 62 miles per hour time to 7.7 .7 seconds. The all wheel system will include a version of Subaru's X mode, providing more or less power as needed to the front or rear axle for grip and stability, along with new grip control for higher speed driving on rough roads. The new platform is also designed for extra rigidity and safety, with crash energy transferred to the body skeleton to protect both the occupants and the driveline's high voltage systems. The front wheel drive model comes with 18 inch wheels as standard, while the four wheel drive variant can be specified with either 18 or 20 inch alloys. Apart from an optional sunroof, Subaru hasn't yet confirmed any further details on the EV's European specifications. However, Subaru has said its electric SUV will have the same 150kW DC rapid charging capability as the Toyota BZ4X, so an 80% recharge should take around 30 minutes. The Solterra is 4,690mm long, 1,860mm wide, and 1,650mm tall, which makes it around the same size as the current generation Forester. The finished Solterra has also adopted some of the bold styling cues from the brand's EV concept car, which was unveiled earlier in 2021. For example, the huge black wheel arc extensions and sharp headlamps have both made their way onto the finished Solterra, although the angular front end has been toned down slightly, likely in the interest of pedestrian safety. The EV market isn't mature yet, so we'll respond to it by deepening our cooperation with Toyota, Subaru CEO Tomomi Nakamura said during a launch event. With up to 126 cubic feet of passenger space, generous rear legroom, and a flat floor, the Solterra gives you the airy, open feel of a much larger vehicle. Available star text trimmed upholstery and high-quality, soft-touch materials throughout create a cabin that's both modern and full of convenient, comfortable features. Solterra gives you up to 30 cubic feet of cargo space, more than the Kia Nero EV, so you can bring along all the gear you need for your adventures. The low load height, a rear gate opening that's over 41 inches wide and an available power rear gate all make loading that gear even easier. If you're hauling larger cargo, raised roof rails are available to take on extra gear, bikes and more. From top to bottom, every part of the 2023 Solterra is part of an evolution in vehicle engineering. 
the twin lip gauge spoilers aren't merely a unique design element, they help manage airflow in concert with a full underbody tray for quiet, efficient, and safe driving regardless of weather and road conditions. The battery will offer fast charging up to 150 kilowatts, but didn't specify how long it would be. Toyota has previously said its BZ4X battery, which is built on the same platform, would get to 80% full in 30 minutes with a 150kW charger. It also said the battery would operate at 90% of its original performance after 10 years of driving or 240,000 km, whichever is shorter. The name Solterra was chosen by joining the Latin word Sol for sun and terra for Earth together, with the company saying it was an appreciation of Mother Nature and to reinforce its intention to further advance coexistence with it. The Solterra, unlike the BZ4X, looks to feature a standard interior and steering wheel. Toyota's electric SUV comes with an optional steering yoke. The Solterra, like Subaru's previous gas-powered SUVs, will have the company's X-Mode and AWD control system, which enhances the sense of security on bumpy roads. According to Subaru, Subaru has been collaborating with Toyota for nearly a decade, having co-developed the Toyota 86 and Subaru BRZ sports cars launched back in 2012. Now, in co-developing both brands' first-ever EVs, Subaru is further tightening its alliances with Japan's number one car maker to acclimatize itself to the once-in-a-lifetime shift to BEVs. We hope to use the lines to build up technology and know-how until the global market shifts fully to battery electric cars, said Nakamura. In a 2020 statement regarding its future lineup, Subaru said it planned to offer EVs, hybrids, and plug-in hybrids that would make up 40% of its global sales by 2030 and 100% by 2035. The CEO believes, however, that within a few short years, BEVs will be an area in which Subaru directly competes with Toyota and others, so will need to further differentiate. The 2023 Solterra features standard EyeSight driver assist technology, which monitors traffic movement, optimizes cruise control, and warns you when you're swaying outside your lane. The automatic pre-collision braking feature can apply full braking force and bring you to a complete stop in emergency situations. Advanced adaptive cruise control with lane change assist can take some of the stress out of driving by helping with steering, braking, and throttle control, both in daily traffic and on long road trips. In early 2020, Subaru was reported as saying that it didn't see much evidence that Americans were interested in switching to electric vehicles or plug-in hybrids. But now with Toyota's collaboration, the automaker is looking to boost its market share in the US, currently hovering around 4.2% last year. The 2023 Solterra features a comprehensive suite of active safety features to help protect you on every drive. A 360-degree surround view camera system is available for enhanced convenience and safety when parking and reversing. The blind spot detection system warns you with a visual indicator on each side mirror if it senses a vehicle in your blind spots. Rear cross-traffic alert helps warn you of traffic approaching from the side as you back up. And with the reverse automatic braking, the Solterra can even stop itself to help avoid objects behind you as the first ever all-electric SUV to feature the capability of symmetrical all-wheel drive, Solterra takes this legendary all-weather, all-terrain traction system to exciting new places. The balanced design of symmetrical all-wheel drive creates uniform stability and delivers an optimal distribution of power for maximum traction and improved handling. Couple that with a smooth linear output of the dual electric motors in the Solterra, and you have outstanding traction and capability on all kinds of road and trail surfaces and in almost any weather condition. Solterra features 8.3 inches of ground clearance and short overhangs for easy maneuverability over rough terrain so you can go places traditional electric vehicles typically can't reach. Standard X mode with hill ascent and descent assist lets you choose the perfect traction setting to match the trail conditions in front of you for enhanced stability and total control. Let us know your opinion in the comment section below. This was all for today. Hope you liked the video. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Hit the bell icon for more updates and notifications.